What's up, everybody? We're back some more Overdrift. Yeah. Before we begin, I'd like to thank Ernie, Lemon Time, Fox Anderson, and Ahi Tenenbra for being members of our Patreon. If you'd like to be a member of our pa Patreon, you go to patreon.com. So you see. Link in the description. Yeah. Uh, and today, uh, I'm going to do a build that uh, I initially thought wouldn't do well, but then uh, I did it on stream, and uh, I mean, it didn't set the world on fire, but it was entertaining, so... Uh, Let's be entertaining. Oh, man. Us? We can't do that. Yeah, I know. But we're going to try. It involves a lance. It's made of thermals. Yes, it's a thermal lance, as it turns out. All right. Let me just clear these guys out before I take my two levels. Um, I think I'm going to get Amp, uh, mainly because it's the most red shield. Ah. For reasons that will become apparent very soon. Because we're going full Darth Maul, baby! <laughs> but, 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 I'm gonna make that noise a lot. Bear with me. <laughs> uh, I'm actually gonna stop using my mouse controls and go full keyboard because uh, aiming with Courser is very difficult for me if uh, I'm using the mouse. No, you gotta use the Force. Uh, but only the dark side of the Force. And since I'm in space, I can do it from the dark side of the moon. It's very cold over there. <laughs> it's true. Okay. Um. Oh, man. I can just, like, force bend stuff to get out of my way. That's true. It's like, there's a bunch of other stuff I want, but I'll grab that. You throw away rerolls. I sure can. I won't, but okay. I sure can. Um... Uh, regeneration's probably not bad in this particular instance. He survived getting cut in half. I'd say that's regeneration. <laughs> uh, grandeur. I can be bigger and lower my rotation speed, which is really not what you want. Not what you want for this build. <laughs> so I'm just going to go with magnitude. So, uh... Yeah, rotation speed is a big problem, so I'm going to get power reserves and I'm going to get agility at some point because nice. uh, turning, you, you want to be able to turn. It's important. When all you are is sword, <laughs> turning is turning is good. <laughs> oh, especially in this early game here. Blech. Yeah. Okay. Um. So there's a couple of things I want here. Uh, but, uh, there is one thing about Sith. Th there's always two. A master and an apprentice. Yeah. So. But Darth Maul never had an apprentice. Or did he? I think he actually did. Did he? Yeah, it was like one of those, like, secret extra lore stuff. Well, that would make it three Sith, then. Oh, because he was the apprentice? Yeah, because he was Sidious' mm. apprentice. Well, yeah, but er, look. Was he Sidious' apprentice? Eh, stuff happens. I don't know, yeah. man. Star Wars. Sidious went through a lot of apprentice. Like, they need to just work on their name games, just like Darth Evilus. <laughs> I mean, I'm pretty sure that was actually one of them, wasn't it? I'm probably. I'm. I know there was like Plagueis and Darth Plagueis the Wise. Just like Darth Badius. Oh, there was Darth Bane. Oh. 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 Oh, no, I'm thinking... I'm thinking Evilus Max. It was the, the big bad of that oh. Joe Cat animations thing. <laughs> you have no idea what I'm talking about. Nope. That's okay. Joe Cat's the guy that does the, the crap guide to D&D. &D. You should go check him out. After this, of course. <laughs> of course. Uh, he, 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 makes, he makes a lot of fantastic uh, Dungeons & Dragons based content. Very funny guy. Uh... Dungeons and Dragons, but that's for nerds. Yeah, but cool nerds. I mean, you have me there. <laughs> uh, blast radius. We gotta make our sword bigger. Vin Diesel plays Dungeons and Dragons. Can't be that nerdy. Yeah, but he's just a big nerd. Um, but yeah, no. Uh, Joe Cat's got the crap guide to D and D is the the big thing, uh, where he goes over like different races and classes and. Ooh, interceptor, nice. All right. Oh, is it a tie interceptor? <laughs> <laughs> um, 
You've taken it too far. <laughs> I'm sorry. Um, it's fine. But he... Uh, Look how useless he is right now. We're, yeah. We're, we're, we're going to make him more useful later, but right now he's he's really <laughs> just showing off the... But that's why he's the apprentice. He doesn't know. Yeah. He's, he's learning. <laughs> he's got the spirit, but... <laughs> a little confused. So uh, we're going to get stabilization uh, to... Oh, and then we're going to get power reserve. Oh, I want all of these. <laughs> Wingman is what's going to make him... Oh, actually Probably helpful? Work. Okay. But uh, let's power get reserves. the power reserves first so I can uh, actually... Yeah, I can spin. Yeah, we're going to get agility too so I can spin even faster, but both are both are needed. Yes. Uh, but yeah, no, uh, Go specifically go watch Joe Cat's um, Crap Guide to Dungeon Mastering. Um, it was a, probably one of his longest videos, but he had a whole thing about how to be a good DM, and basically, what what do you do when your players are madmen and <laughs> want to just, you know, be crazy psychopaths that murder everyone and, like, strap black holes to arrows and <laughs> be bards that seduce everything. Um, and in All that, right. Evilus Max is the big bad, and it was a whole, it was a whole thing. Come along for the ride, baby. Ba, 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 ba. He's dead. <laughs> Very nice. We'll, we'll, we'll work on his survivability. <laughs> He's got much to learn. If you have the technology, you can rebuild him. Oh, that's a bathroom. Now, who's the who was Darth Ball's apprentice? Darth Maul. It's like, I don't remember. Like, I could be completely wrong, too. Like, it's. Not out of the realm of possibility, but I, I could have sworn I heard something about it, and like, I don't know if it was, like, in a book, what it was. Uh, a lot of things here I want. I'm going to get elegant construction, because that's going to help my apprentice not be dead. But, 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 but. I'm sure some people in the, in the in the chat already know. In the chat, yeah. In the comments already know. Yeah, this is not live. Uh, I'm live every Tuesday and Thursday, though. Yeah, on twitch.com slash Ultrasea. Ultrasea Gaming? Ultrasea Gaming. Ultrasea Gaming. Uh, bu -bu 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 -bu. Apparently, Darth Maul had two apprentices, both after he was sliced in half, because it makes sense he was no longer Darth Maul, uh, Darth Sidious's yeah. apprentice at that point. Yeah, see? Uh, he had Savage Oppress... Oh boy. Oh bananas. Oh careful. Yeah, I'm just gonna just recover for a moment. Yeah, shields are already down, so Mom, Yeah, it's just this guy sucks. I, yeah. I gotta get near him. Um what? Uh I gain rate of fire and nothing I wanna gain from uh evolutionary niche, so don't worry about it. Uh, priority zero is something I would really like to get online because you know we got wingman. Uh, like uh, the ability to take less damage, for example. The ability for my apprentice's sword to be bigger with overclock. Speaking of which, I still have plenty of things that I need to improve my own sword. Uh, like oh well, there's overclock. But I'm gonna get payload because you, you you want charge shot with this. You want it. You need it. I'm gonna work towards it. So so what are you learning over there, Mister Mister Wikipedia man? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It looks like looks like depending on where you looked, he had an apprentice two different times. Uh, one was in like the the Clone Wars or Rebels or something like that, and. He actually, he and his apprentice actually went to try to fight Sidious at one point. Uh, and then there was one where it was like a weird Star Wars Brotherhood game or Star Wars Legends or something like that. Sure. Where he had a, he had a, an apprentice in there too. And so, there you go. I don't know if you count, as, count him as a Sith apprentice, but this is, what you've got going here definitely seems more like that first guy. Okay. God by young apprentice. Uh, we're all off filter now. Okay, we'll take that out. Uh, we'll just 
hit him with the old strafe, strafe and bake. Yeah. There we go. Major antagonist in the Star Wars Clone Wars TV series, Savage Oppress was both Darth Maul's long lost brother and apprentice. See, I knew I wasn't crazy. So there you go. Darth Maul and Savage Oppress. Both used the dual bladed lightsaber too, so there's your there, there you go. Bup 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 bup. <laughs> 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 just wiggle, wiggle. Yeah, there, there's a lot of wiggle. Uh, there's a windmill maneuver. That, yep. that, that's a key key move. Pretty sure that when Maul does it, it's a little faster than that. Well, I don't have agility been... yet. I don't have agility yet. Give, uh, okay, give, give okay. me time. Hey, look, agility. Well, all right. Bup, 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 bup. All right, there we go. We're starting to, We're starting to get into it now. Yeah. We still got a couple of things we gotta get. Uh, let's see. Um, let's let's read it all. Ah, here we go. Ah, it's overpower and their support specialists. I want all of them. Uh, polar inversion would be nice. Uh, just for the extra blast radius, and we can pull things in a little bit easier. Uh, just did, getting the the bigger blast radius in general would be nice. Could make my sword bigger. Did Darth Maul have force pull? Uh, I mean, probably. Oh, did you see that dodge? That was pretty good. Did you see that dodge? No. Or that one? No. That one. All right. <laughs> I'm gonna need <laughs> you to stop. Uh, rate of fire or blast <coughs> radius? Which one would I like to take? I'm gonna get. The rate of fire first. I don't know which one has more of an impact on my sword length because they both affect it. Yep. Uh, if it's one to one, then this one's technically not as good. But at least I'm in the tree now, so I don't gotta keep. You know, let, let the game know that I'm interested. Yeah. Uh, support specialist, because I only have the one apprentice, so that's fine. So he'll get much better. So now his sword is just about as big as mine. Just about. Uh, I will need to get uh, a whole strength at some point so I can get Rancor. Uh, and then, uh, I don't know what else I'd even really need. Yep, got him. Oh, stop. Watching my XP go. No! <laughs> sword bits flying off too. Yeah, I got plenty of bits. And if you've got plenty of bits, we could always use them over at Twitch.com. <laughs> uh. Okay. Get all that XP. Lose all the head shield. Okay. You know, um. I will say... Not necessarily a, a point to taking Maelstrom if your shield keeps breaking. Um, well, we'll work on it. Shield cool down. There you go. Uh, let me get that XP before it goes away. And another boost! Oh, and a lot of XP. Uh, let's search for things here. Mm, I mean, volatile shields might be nice because yeah. it's gonna pop fairly often. That's true. Uh, let's see, adaptive armor is fine. I'd like to get whole strength, like I said, for the rancor. Yeah. Uh, since I'm using such a thin shield, I can go for like an emergency system tempest break situation. Yeah. We got options. I, I personally don't think that uh, Amp is the most ideal shield for this, but it's the, it's the only shield that makes me red. And if I'm being Darth Maul, I need, I need to have the, the red lightsaber, so it was important. To be fair, your lightsaber almost looks more yellow here. 
Well, it's just because of the, 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 the heat, the heatness, the heatness, the, the heat. Okay, we're just gonna. It's like the tips of the right, right? That took out. Oh, careful! Yeah, fair amount. So we blew off his fingers. Okay, we're just gonna clear these mines real quick. Try to avoid that as much as we can. Him with the old spin maneuver. You can't beat the spin move. What? Nothing can survive the spin move. Is that true? Probably. Oh, there goes my shield. Your shield can survive the spin move. It's, like I said, nothing can survive the oh, spin right. move. Oh, <laughs> right. Uh, okay. Uh, ally, well, ally specialists. specialists. Well... That seems appropriate. Yeah. As it turns out, I'm very specialized. What? Yes, I was like, shield, go away, please. The rest of you go away, please. And with the spin move! Another boost! Oh, I just spin just... Right around to the other side. Ooh, that guy. That was surviving the spin move. Tactical link. I've been I've been searching for you. There you go. Now, me and my apprentice take less damage. Well, actually, it's my apprentice and I. So me and my apprentice take less damage. Okay. Good. <laughs> uh, I also rebel against proper grammar. Um. But grammar I... makes the best cookies. <laughs> Good old grammar. All right, we got the flash shielding now. I probably shouldn't have gone flash shielding until I had some of the other things in place, but I did it. You did. Ain't no going back now. There's no going back for me. All right. Almost at wave 100. That'd be a neat mod. If you could remove a mod later on. Uh, that used to be a thing. Well, well not not a mod. There, there used to be, like, yeah. re, was it Rebirth? Yeah, it's just all mods. Go away. <laughs> it's like Start everything over. goes away. You get all the levels back. And you don't like what you're doing? Do it again. Do it again. Ooh, what a dodge. That's not bad. Shield's down. Yeah, well, it's gonna happen. Bonk, bonk. Ah, oh, dang it. Oh, I walked right into it because yeah. I got confused between <laughs> Master and Apprentice. Uh, let's see. Warpath is fine, but. Eh. Uh, bigger sword. Could be good. Like, I really should get defensive-y things. Yes, but, you should. But bigger sword. It's like defensive in the fact that I could be further away. I mean, suppose that's fair. Ow. Ow. Oh. I'm just gonna, we're gonna recover for just a hot second. Uh, he's gonna get his thing off. And singularity. But thankfully... The lance is one of the few weapons that just cuts right through his spinning defensive nonsense. Makes sense. Uh, speaking of spinning defensive nonsense, spin move! Uh, I don't want you here right now. Fine. We're diving, we're ducking, we're dipping, we're diving, we're dodging. Yeah. Five D the five D's of dodge drift. <laughs> Dive, duck, dip, dive and drift. Yeah. Okay. Um I, I, Death Blossom would be great. Except that the Death Blossom for yeah. Lance is so so, so you got Sad. Death Blossom, you got Durability. You know, I'm going to do it anyway. Sweet. <laughs> Just, sweet. 
Just do it. Look, our shield's gonna break a lot. Even if it's lackluster, it's still something. But you have to do Oh it. yeah, do you see all you see all those sparks? Yeah, you have to do. Do 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 do. I see what you did 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 there. It's time to <laughs> duel. Don't give it on one. Spin move! <laughs> uh. Wave 100. With a friend, okay. with your friend over there, it looks more like you've got a pair of chopsticks that you're trying to like. Oh, what's what's the force if not a pair of chopsticks? What? No, man, I think that might have been deep. I'm not entirely certain yet. <laughs> got him. <laughs> uh, rupture is fine, but not super necessary for this build. That's not necessary for this build. What? I think we search for things that are actually necessary to this build. Uh, I will need improved thrusters to get Deadly Wake to get uh, Tempest Break. I will need Kinetic Boost to get down to Emergency Systems. I want both of those things. Uh, let's work on getting Tempest, Tempest Break off first. Yes. I mean, Blink's not a bad thing to have as well, just in case. Oh, absolutely. Everyone knows that Jedi's can blink. I was trying to think if there was a Jedi that couldn't blink, but... Uh, that one, the uh, blind Jedi probably could blink. I'm sure there was a blind Jedi somewhere. No, I mean, if you watched Rogue One, there was a blind Jedi. I haven't seen Rogue One yet. Oh, well, there's a blind Jedi. Huh. <laughs> huh. I actually don't know. I think he was a Jedi. I'm fairly confident. He was a, he was a blind guy who, who kicked a lot of ass. I think he was a Jedi. But I could be wrong. I often am. People will correct me. Spin move. <laughs> Spin move. Uh, let's see. There's the whole strength, but we gotta get the other butt fire. Line ourselves, line ourselves up for uh, breaking tempests. Okay. We got a big old juggernaut. Uh, also, we're still looking for um, polar inversion. I'd love to find a polar inversion. What are you looking up now? Uh, are you looking up the, the guy I was referring to? Yeah. Well, you, you should vocalize your intent so that the people who can't see you know. No. <laughs> uh, let's see. There was Ron Kota, who was a Jedi Master in general during the Clone Wars. Is that the guy? Uh, is one of them. Was he the blind guy? He was blinded. Oh well, yeah. By. Either Vader or his apprentice, it seems conflicting. Uh, let's see, there's a blink, but I don't need the blink yet. We got 10 rerolls. Let's find the things we need. Uh,. Come on, game. Find me the things I need. Alright, I guess I'll take whole strength. That's lower on the tier list of things I, I need, but I don't want to blow all of my re-rolls. Re and having whole strength is a defensive trait. My shield's going to be breaking a lot. I should take it. Uh, there was also... This dude. Oh, this Sh Shirut Imwe? Who may or may not have been a Jedi? <laughs> but he was a badass. Oh, let's 
see the guy in Rogue One. He was the guy in Rogue One. Okay. But there were... So, so his, his... His actual Jedi status is apparently in question. Okay. Because he never uses Force abilities. It's theoretically implied that he's force sensitive, but might not actually be a Jedi. Hard to say. I'm also, you know, very cursory looks in, in Google and Wikipedia and, and Wikipedia, respectively. <laughs> Wikipedia and Wikipedia. Wikipedia, man. So we have all of the the pedias. <laughs> oh boy, there's there's a, a lot going on here. Yeah. I'd warn you to get your shields down, but you already know. There it goes again. Yeah. Oh, that Seraph is about to... Uh, that's not a Seraph, that's a... Oh. Well. That was unfortunate. He, like, charged through and just... I, there, like, a big yeah. celestial pack combined with a... Freaking... Uh, angry Juggernaut. Ugh. Uh... You know that build can do better. I, it can do so much better. But it did good. No, it didn't. It was wave 125. Yeah. 128. That's it, good for most people, eh? No, look. If I don't get to, like, around wave 200, then I'm I'm pretty disappointed. My goodness. I remember when, when the goal was, as long as we beat Punchy, it's a successful video. Yes, but you've been, I've been doing this for better. a long time now. Yeah. Now, now the, the, the goals have shifted. I know. The goalposts shift. That's what they do. Yeah, this just isn't that good. That's good. Eh. I didn't even get everything off the ground that I wanted to. Is... What were you still missing? I didn't have Tempest Break. I didn't have emergency systems. Yeah. Which all would have kept me alive. True. Uh, I never found Polar Inversion. Um, just... I didn't have everything I needed. Eh. <laughs> um, yeah, mediocre at best. So, and I uh, apologize for the disappointment, but that's just what the Sith do. <laughs> They're cut down in their prime. Yeah. And they're just a bunch of failures who will still somehow come back in a sequel or two. Yeah. I mean, uh, I'm pretty sure every Sith we've ever seen has come back. Uh, except for, like, Dooku. Yeah, I was going to say, I don't think Dooku came back. He, uh... He really got a head in life. Uh, his head got cut off. Yeah. I know, we'll see you guys next time. Hey, right, bye. Thank <laughs> you.